we're back <clears throat> after a six week break. We are back at the combi again, so brilliant. We've turned the combi round, and this week we're going to be coming up this side here, just the bottom half. Um, yesterday I had a quick crack at the, uh, just this corner here, so that's done, that's coated. I'm going to come up along this side, and we're going to, have to take out the gas compartment, take this off, and uh, go around and get, make our way to the front. Let's get going. So one of the things that we've got to do on this side is to uh, <coughs> take this gas compartment out for the gas canister. It's basically in this external compartment so that you don't get gas leakage on the inside of the combi. I'm going to replace this and I want to take it out. So here's the old gas canister, the old camping stove. This is the old fitting for the external gas canister, which you can which could go into here. That feeds into the stove on the inside. I'll just take this out. So now we've just got the old copper pipe which goes into the internal stove. That's just loose, that goes underneath the combi. And yesterday I've drilled out rivets that were holding it in place. And then it's also glued on the outside, so I've been loosening that just with a screwdriver. And so that's all now starting to come apart, come off. And so I'll con continue that process. We're going to pull this out and we'll have a big hole in the combi. Oh, look at this. So this is straight into the combi now. So this is like the internal cupboard space. Here's my, here's one of my pots. I must remember to take them out before I go driving anywhere. So have a look at this. See what I can see immediately. There's some sort of wooden flooring in here that's rotten. And, disgusting. and there's also some rotten and disgusting metal. Underneath it. Look at that. It's got a nasty rust pocket here, so I'm going to have to fix all of that. So this is really nastily rusted. Yeah, and I can just immediately see I've got some work to do, but the rest of it further in. Further in is fine. Just this bit here that's been exposed to the weather underneath this grill. This has been essentially outside and unprotected. Wow. Okay. Cool. So this is uh, the door here, we've got the compartment out now, and these hinges are actually riveted on, not screwed, and uh, so I'm going to have to drill these out. Right, I better clean the cupboards out then. There we go. So uh, now we're just going to clean up all around the edge of it. Move on. <laughs> 